guarantee you, you came on this video because you're trying to learn kick flips or heel flips and now you don't know how to land it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you what you're doing wrong. And this is mostly the common mistakes that most people have when learning kick flips. So let's just get into this video. I will be showing you guys an ollie. And let me ask you, what is the most important step of an ollie that makes you go up? There are two important keys to an ollie. One is sliding your foot up. And the other is bending your knees up to your chest like if you're sucking them into your body. How is this related to a kickflip or a heel flip or any kind of flip trick? Well, if you look at my kickflips, I'm doing exactly the same thing as an ollie. I'm flicking my foot out and I'm sucking both feet up to my chest like I'm sucking it into my body. So that way I could get on top of my board. The common mistake that people do is they flick down and then they put their foot on the ground like I'm showing over here. If you keep doing this, you're never going to be able to land a kickflip because you're not being on top of the board. You have to actually jump with your board. If you want to practice a step, try flicking and then trying to put your knee up to your chest or try to grab your knee with your hands. So that way you have that feel of lifting your knee up in midair. So here's a good routine you could do. Just slide your front foot up on the board and then just lift it up and then put it back down on the board. Also with your back foot, you want to lift it up as well once you pop it. So while you're sliding up your front foot, you also want to lift your back foot up. And that's how you're also able to get pretty good ollies. If you really want to, you just work on that little routine. And I'll show you guys some examples of uh, stationary tricks is the first one i'm going to do is a heel flip so when you want to flick you straighten your front foot out and once you straighten your front foot out you want to bend it back to your chest just like how i was saying before you want to suck your feet into your body so you could get on top of the board but that's mostly the common mistake that most people do is just they don't suck their knees up they just jump and then they just fall down in front of their board or below their board another good step is to just stand in front of your board Keep your shoulders parallel with your legs forward and just jump up a couple times up and down. This applies to all stances, whether you're skating regular, switch, nolly, fakie. As long as you're able to jump up with your board and you're able to suck your knees up to your chest, then you'll be able to land any trick and you'll be able to pop a lot more higher when you're going up to a ledge or any kind of skate spot that you're going to be skating at. And you're able to jump up with your board and be one with your board, then you'll be able to do any trick much more higher and better. Just like how I'm showing in this tray flip. And if you guys have any comments, concerns, then please leave it in the comments below. And then uh, I'll try to get to you guys as soon as possible.